Good morning, Eisenhower Eagles. Today is Tuesday, November 28th, cycle day nine. That means you're going to have music today. Let's go ahead and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, boys and girls, you may be seated for lunch today. Three options. You have hot dog is your A option. B option is grilled cheese sandwich. And your C option is pepperoni and cheddar kids bowl. Your sides are carrots and then obviously the salad bar option. All right. Birthdays, like I said, it's November. Zero birthdays today because we have none left in November. All right, boys and girls. Um... Reminder, outside, it has melted and dried up, so we will be able to go outside if it warms up enough for recess. Um, just remember, stay off the ice. It is not an ice skating rink. You don't have ice skates. You're not allowed to bring ice skates. Um, just stay off the ice because you could slip and fall and hit your head. We sent out an email last night to everybody's folks, um, and so everybody should have received an update on what our regulations and rules are for going outside and playing in the snow. You have to have waterproof pants, or I'm sorry, waterproof shoes and or boots if you want to get in them. If you have questions, you can ask your teacher. They will give the professional um judgment on whether they are waterproof or not that does not mean you just bring in your spare pair of nikes or adidas or uh whatever shoe you wear just so they can get wet and your socks still get wet and your feet are still wet and then you change back into dry shoes but then your feet are still wet and it makes for an uncomfortable day and your feet get stinky we don't want stinky feet in the building okay um, so remember, it has to be that. It has to be waterproof um, pants, or not pants, here it goes, Miss Lash Pelican, waterproof boots or shoes to be able to play and walk in the snow and be in the snow. Remember also, snow stays on the ground. If you are caught making a snowball and throwing it or throwing snow at all or any ice chunks that are left behind, you may lose your privilege of being at recess outside and have to find an alternate location to sit at during recess, okay? Whether it's another classroom or whether it's with another teacher or whether you stay in with your teacher and the rest of your class goes out with another teacher, okay? It's really up to the adult and your teacher what happens, okay? All right, we do have a couple, couple of special announcements. With our Butter Braids results, we have our top three people. And the, these top three people will receive a prize. Our PTO brought in these prizes for them yesterday. All right, so our third top seller was in fifth grade, Mr. Beckett. Beckett, congratulations. You are our third top seller in the school. Second top seller of Butter Braids was Faith Lynn. Faith Lynn, congratulations. You'll be getting your prize from your teacher as well. So Faith Lynn was our second. And our top seller, Miss Caroline. Caroline, congratulations. You are a top seller. You will get the other prize from your teacher as well. All right. So those are our three top sellers in the school for Butter Raise. And boys and girls, um, that sale, those sales raised enough money to help cover the rest of the playground whenever that shows up. It has been ordered. Now we just have to pay for it when it gets here. I don't know when it's going to get here. It's supposed to get here before we leave for Christmas or winter break. So we'll see if it does or not, okay? Now, it might not get set up before then, but if it comes and arrives and then shows up, then at least we have it, and then we just have to wait for a couple guys to come down and uh, set it up and put it together. So we'll see how that goes. All right. I promise I would do a joke again. You guys ready? What do you call a funny mountain? A hill areas. <laughs> Get it? Funny mountain hill areas. 
pretty good right there. All right, boys, girls, boys town. Skill for this week is making an apology. One, you want to look at the person. Two, use a sincere and a serious voice. Three, say I'm sorry for, or I want to apologize for. Then explain how you plan to do better in the future. And then say, thanks for listening. Okay? All right. Those are our boys' cause. Our boys town skill for the day. All right. <clears throat> Make it an apology. All right, boys and girls, I'm going to close it out for that. I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Remember, you're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting, so get on your way. Boys and girls, have a wonderful day. And if you want to be an Eisenhower Eagle, you need to work hard. You have to be kind. Then we can soar like eagles. We'll see everybody later. Have a great day. Bye.